In this video, I am going to show you guys how to measure voltage in series parallels using multisim. So let's get started. There you can see this is a series parallel circuit. If you guys don't understand that how come this is a series parallel circuit, please don't forget to comment on my channel. It's obvious because you can see R1 and R2 is in series. R3 and R4 is in series, but both of them are parallel to each other. So I have like five multimeter that I get. Now I will measure each of them. So first I will measure R1. As you guys can see and when you measure it it should be parallel you have to measure it parallelly now I'm gonna do it with R2 positive end is going to the top and negative will come to the down you can play with the wires to make it look nice and then the multimeter 4 will go to R3 resistor now multimeter 5 will go to R4 and then I'll press the run button on the top and click on each of the resistors to see the voltage. I have 6.6 .6 volts, 5 volts, 9.4 volts, then get all of them and then 11 volts, 5 volts. So when you add them, when you add 6.6 .6 volt and 9.4, it will give you 16. Why? Because check it out, multimeter 1 is giving you 16 volts. Your total voltage is 16 and R1 and R2 is parallel with V1. So when you add them, they're, they're in series, but they're parallel with V1. So when you add them, R1 plus R2 is supposed to give you equal to V1. Same thing with R3 and R4. When you add them, it's supposed to give you exact value like V1 because this is also parallel with the, with the, with the total voltage and we know that parallel circuit voltage are equal so i hope you guys like this video if you think you learned from this video don't forget to subscribe like and if anything you didn't understand please don't forget to comment thank you so much